Welcome to your wedding shred workout. This workout is a part of the Bridal Bar Bootcamp that gets you in wedding shape in 30 days. Receive this entire program in your inbox by signing up with the link below. Be sure to subscribe and hit that like button. And now let's get into the workout. Okay, let's begin with a warm up. I have my ankle weights on my wrists as an option to just add that extra burn. Okay, so we're gonna start with just nice little knee lifts to warm up, 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 up. Good, and when you're ready, bring the elbows down towards the knees. Eight more like this for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. We're gonna add a twist right here. Good, twist, twist. Good, elbows down, down, down. Good, for four, three, two, one. Good, let's take a second position. Little plies right here, plie, plie. Good, reach through those fingertips. Bring the arms together right here, and we're gonna add a little twist right here. Twist it side together, side, center, side. Four more, four, three, two. Let's hold it right here, lift the heel up. Little twist and twist and twist and twist. Good, other side, twist together, twist center. Four more, four, three, two. One, hold it right here, little lift of the heel. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, stay right here. Pulse it out, just alternate through the heels. Alternate, good. I know those arms are starting to get tired with those wrist weights there. Make sure that you keep those elbows lifted right here. Last eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, one, nice job. All right, we're gonna take a nice big inhale in. We're gonna round it forward and then open it up right here. Good, round and open. Round and open. Two more like this. Two, and one, good job. All right, let's come to the floor and we're gonna work on some core right here. So grab those weights. Yes, we're gonna add a little bit of weight. Now, all you're gonna do is just gonna lift one leg up at a time, okay? So we're just going to lift in. Adding a little bicep curl right here. Good, for eight, seven, six, five, four. Try to stretch the biceps. Three, two, one. Left leg, here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, good, we're gonna add a little bit of a twist. Up, twist, up, twist. Hold to the right, pulse it out for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, left side, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two, one, good, come on up. If ever it becomes too much, you can either take off the wrist weights or the hand weights. We're gonna roll down slow. We're gonna roll up slow.
Nice, drop those hand weights right there. Bring the hands together, knees up, pulse it up. Up, 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 up. Nice, keep going up, up. Reach the arms out, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now we're gonna lay it all the way out, all the way in. Yes, you can, here we go, ready? Lift tall through the chest, and eight, up, nice and slow, seven, up, six, five, four, keep those legs together, three, two, one, and up, good. Lay all the way down, grab those weights. We're gonna bring the legs at this diamond position right here. We're gonna tap the toes to the floor and come back up. Right now, just keep the palms on the floor like this. All right, curl through that chin. So chin to chest, press that belly button down into the floor. Nice. Four more right here. And four. Two, one, hold this little diamond position. We're gonna punch it up, 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 up. Good, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, we're gonna tap one foot down, the other one comes up. I shouldn't care, but it still hurts. I didn't realize the danger, cause you're the end of the rainbow. If it ever becomes too much, just put that he head on the floor right there. All right? Whew. Here we go, let's go a little quicker. And tap, and tap, and tap, and tap. Good for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, we're gonna twist it out right here, twist and come back to the center. Twist, right foot comes down, twist to the outside and up. Good. Other side, here we go. Four, three, two, and one. Good, place those hands back down to the floor. Let's drop the legs down. And up, one more time, eight times right here. Eight, up, seven, up, six, good, five. You're gonna feel those inner thighs work. Four, three, two, and one, good, drop those weights right there. Place the hands behind the head, bring the knees together. We're gonna twist it out right here. And twist, and twist, twist, twist. Eight more right here for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Good, hold that knee in towards your chest. We're gonna lower the leg and lift, nice, for eight. And up, seven. Good, make those elbows nice and wide. Four, chin in towards your chest. Three, two, and one. It's the last move right here. We're gonna stand up, move into arms. Even though we've been getting a lot in the arms already. Eight, seven, you're doing so good. Six, five, Four, whew, three, two, and one. All right, lots of good core right there. Let's stand on up. I'm gonna keep my wrist weights on, my ankles or my wrists. We're gonna move into some arms here. So let's just start standing, squeeze those shoulder blades back behind you like this. Squeeze, squeeze. So that core is nice and tight. 
I can feel it definitely on fire. Keep using it throughout the rest of the class. Nice, we're gonna reach forward and squeeze. Forward, squeeze. I want you to really feel that posture, right? This is all about you getting ready for your big day. Feeling confident in your body is the best way to prepare for something big, right? Feeling grounded, secure in your body. Such a gift, right? So I'm really glad you're here. Whew. Here we go, we're gonna reach up, in, up, and up. Let's hold the right, punch it. Up, up, three, four, five, six, seven. Other side, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Nice, reach out. So over and under right here for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Nice, bring it here and up down and up. Good, we're gonna punch it out to the diagonal, in and out. Good, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, other side. One, keep that core nice and tight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good, push it in and out. And squeeze those shoulder blades back behind you. Lift your chest up tall. Good for four, three, Two, one, we're gonna hold it here, just little ins and outs. Three, four, five, six, seven, switch sides. And for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good, bring both those hands behind you. Squeeze those shoulder blades together, and then just lift right here. Up, and up, and up, and up. Take a little deeper bend with those knees. Maybe pitch forward just a slightly bit more. Nice, now we're gonna bend and feel like you're putting something in your back pockets. In and reach. Bend up, reach. Bend and reach. Four more like this. Four and three and two and one. Good, we're gonna take those legs out nice and wide. We're gonna come into a nice Big deep plie right here with the weights. Continue to use those arms as we start to get into the legs a little bit here. Good, pulse, pulse. Keep that core nice and tight. Squeeze your booty underneath you. Remember your head, shoulders, hips, one line, like you're going up and down a wall. Good, and pulse, 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 good. Spread those toes out wide. Make sure that you're not crunching up through the feet. Nice, for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, we're gonna reach it up, in, up, and. Working our arms and legs all at the same time. Four, three, two, and one. Let's hold it up here, little pulses up, up. Good, bring those hands all the way together. Bring them down behind your head towards your neck. Reach it long for a nice tricep extension and lift. Keep that core nice and tight. Eight, seven, six, five. Squeeze that booty for three, two, and one. Hold it here and pulse it out for eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, and one, good. All right, we're going to 
bring the weights down, grab your chair. We're gonna go into some leg work here with the chair. Okay, so coming into a little first position, so the way you find your first is you just kinda lean back into your heels, let your toes open, okay? Do not force it, don't do that. Find your first. Okay, now squeeze that booty really tight. Where we're using all those external hip rotators here. And we're gonna lift up onto our toes, but this time we're gonna take the heels a little bit together, okay? Heels are lifted and they're squeezing together. I want you to feel that connection all through the inner thighs, all right? So we're just going to add a little plie. Now if at any time the wrist weights are too much, just take them off. I like to have them just get that extra little arm workout through the whole class. Good, we're just gonna pulse it out right here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more set of eight. Make sure that your elbow's nice and lifted. You got this nice curve right here. Reach the arm up, we're gonna bring elbow to hip and squeeze, good. Getting a little sassy with those hips. Yes, try to get lower, I know it burns. Three, two, and one more set of eight, you can do it. Eight, Woo. seven, six, get a nice burn right there. Five, good, four, three, if you smile it helps, two, and one. Good, now we're gonna step it forward and then step it back like that. All right, if you wanna add an arm, you can just reach and squeeze it in. All right, just like that. Good, For, we're gonna go a little bit faster now. Here we go. Forward and back. Forward and back, good. For four, three, two, and one. Hold it right here. We're gonna just do a little lift, tap. Lift, tap. Good, for six, five, four, three, Two, let's do one more set of eight right here. Eight, seven, you can bring the arm up. Six, five, four, three, two. We're gonna pulse it up, hold it right here, you could do it, yes. Last eight, seven, six, five, four. Get really high up onto those toes. Let's do one more set of eight. You've got it, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, and one. Okay, Whew, shake it out. Let's switch it to the other side right away. So remember, find your first, come up onto your heels. Little plie, squeeze those glutes. Don't let the knees come in. Let's start with just our nice, simple pulses. Pulse, 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 good. Curve that arm. This is where you get to really shape those beautiful ballerina arms. Those black swan arms, right? Elbow lifts up, shoulders down. Feel radiant through your heart, through your chest. Nice, good, last eight, seven. We're burning those thighs out. Four, three, two, reach the arm up, squeeze up. So my hips are coming up towards my ribs. I'm getting a little bit deeper into my legs. Woo, definitely feeling it now. Squeeze, squeeze, keep that core nice and tight. Last eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good, oh man, thighs are burning. Step it forward, step back. We're gonna add a little pull in, reach. We're doing four slow, and then we'll take it fast. Last one slow right here. Here we go. Step forward and back. Forward and back. So nice, pretty arm right here. Reach through those fingertips. In and reach. In and reach. Three, two, and one. Good, hold it here. Now we're gonna lift that arm up. Oh no, let's keep it here first. So I'm in a nice little fourth position. Lift and lift. So I 
want you to think about your posture here. So you're not going like this. You're staying tall. Use your core to lift the leg up. Four more right here for four, three, two, one. We're gonna pulse it out, I know. Eight, seven, six, five. You've got it, four, three, two. Hold on to that core, sit up taller. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Feel those inner thighs. Two, and one. Okay, wow. Shake that out. Now, we're gonna take the bar or your chair right over here. Let's take a quick stretch. Grab onto that ankle. Whew. Lots of really good thigh work, inner thigh posture work, right? All that was working there. Okay, switch. Whew. Catch your breath. Hope you're feeling the burn. And most of all, having fun, right? So I always say, it's not a workout, we're just I don't know, enjoying ourselves, right? Okay, so now we're gonna leave our heels on the ground, come into your first. Heels press into the ground this time, okay? So we're gonna press and up. So we're just doing little demi-plie. Heels stay glued to the floor. Oh, I forgot, actually. Let's put the, the wrist weights on the ankles. Totally forgot. Okay, switch those around if you haven't yet. So let's switch it because now we are working the legs and we don't need them on the arms anymore. Our arms finally get a little break. All right, because we're gonna work on our booty. So, here we go. And down, up, down, and up. Squeeze those glutes. You're balancing a book on the top of your head. Check in shoulders, hips, heels, all one line. Good for four. And three, two, and one. Stay in your plie, just reach the left leg back behind you just like this. We're gonna do a little lift, tap down, eight times. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more set of eight right here. Eight, keep that core tight, seven, Six, five. Hold it up here. Here we go, we're gonna just pulse and lift. Good, for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, good, bring that toe. You're gonna come coop it right behind your back calf there. And then we're gonna extend back like that. Two sets of eight again for eight, seven, six, five. Good, both knees bend, both knees straighten. Three, two, one. One more set of eight, here we go. Eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and one. Good, now we're gonna hold that leg up there, right there, so both legs are straight this time. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Another set of eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, now we're gonna add a little coupe. We're gonna go side this time. Coupe, my bottom knee bends. Everything straightens together. Eight. Seven. If you wanna bring the leg up a little higher, you can. Six. Just make sure that you're keeping the posture tall. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Good, now we're gonna kick low, kick medium, kick high. All right, low, medium, high. This is the last one for this leg. Four. Three. Two. 
and one. All right, Whew, a lot in that booty, right? Okay, now we're gonna switch sides. So just come right here. And let's just start with our plies again. So I was working my left side, even though both sides really get worked a lot from standing. Okay, catch your breath, come back into your body here. Really think about squeezing through the glutes. Core is nice and tight. All right, let's come into our plie. Tondu the leg behind you, so just a little pointed back. We're just gonna lift and lower. Lift, lower. Make sure that this standing knee stays turned out. Five, four, good. Three, two, one more set of eight right here. Eight, seven, six. You're keeping me on. Two, and one. We're gonna hold it right here, just pulse it out. Eight, seven, press into the bar here. Use that to help with your posture. Standing leg stays bent. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, bring it back into coupe here. Extend, this time the bottom leg straightens. They both bend in and they both straighten right here. Two sets of eight, here we go. Eight, seven. One more set of eight. Two, let's hold the last one. Here we go, hold it up for eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Another set of eight, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, whew. All right, a little coupe to the side and back. Here we go, coupe, side. Four parts, low, medium, high. Starting in coupe, here we go. Low, medium, high, and in. Low, medium, high. Last two. All right, we're gonna add a little bonus here. We're gonna go passe to arabesque, switch the legs. Passe, arabesque, switch. Okay, so I'm just lifting my toe all the way up to my knee, expanding out, switching, doing the same thing on the other side. Whew. Two, and one. We're gonna take the right leg, we're gonna just do nice big kicks for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Other side, here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, good job. Okay, that was a lot. We're gonna end with just one last thing here on our backs. Roll all the way back. Little final finisher right here. 
We're gonna add a little bridges right here. So squeeze those glutes underneath you, press the palms into the floor and lift up, up, up. Make sure that you're tucking the pelvis under, ribs are in, palms are pressed down into the floor. Another set of eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Good, bring the right leg up. We're gonna kick it up and out. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold it up, let's pulse it up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, switch. Good, up, out, up, out. With the left leg now. Four, three, two, one. Pulse it out, pulse it up. Good. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Good, place both the feet down. This time come up onto your tippy toes. Squeeze the glutes underneath you. We're gonna open everything up. Squeeze it all up to the top, ribs down. Here we go. For eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here, a little pulses up and up. This is your finisher right here. You've got it. Keep tucking under, long low back. Last eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and let it go. Oh, you made it. We both made it. Oh man. That was a good one. Let's take the foot over the knee. Oh, hurts so good right there, right? Feel that outer glute stretch and release. Take a nice big deep breath in and switch sides. It's so important to make sure that you're Recovering, taking some time to just breathe and stretch into your body. You did such a good job. I know you're coming back here doing it again and again for the full 30 day program, right? Make sure that you're checking in with me in the comments down below. I love just hearing how you're doing, how it's going for you, how it's making a difference in your whole process. Let's take one more stretch right here. And just know that I'm going along with this or in this with you as well. These are the workouts that I'm using for myself to stay grounded and to lead up to my big day as well. So I hope we can send each other all those good positive vibes. Good job. Awesome job, you made it all the way through. Now, if you're wanting to upgrade your experience and get the best results, then download my brand new bar definition app available now in the app store where you can get your bonus finishers, recipes, and notifications to help keep you on track. Download it now and I'll see you in the next workout. Bye.